Well, just in time for the holidays, we get an inside look at what our lawmakers gift their constituents when they get an office visit at the Capitol. WENY Washington Bureau Chief Jacqueline Paula Castro takes us around to, un to uncover the best office treats. Two, one. It's the most wonderful time of the year. It's the most wonderful time of the year for free stuff inside the U.S. Capitol. In Ohio Senator Sherrod Brown's office, it's Dum Dums made in Bryan, Ohio at Spangler Candies. But did you know it's not just Dum Dums they make? They're one of the few domestic manufacturers to still make candy canes, and they they um, they found a way to be able to do it profitably. Most of that, most of candy cane manufacturing is offshore, and Spangler does it in Bryan, Ohio, and how great is that? All the little gifts inside the Capitol offices are donated from home state producers. Everything falls under the gifts rule, which allows small monetary value gifts to be given from the office when they're donated. I've got the inside scoop. Senate staffers made this list of their favorite office giveaways, and I'm checking it twice. It's the half happiest season. I'm here in New York Senator Kirsten Gillibrand's office. You can see it's all decked for the holidays with a Christmas tree and everything. And this is one of the favorite offices on that giveaway list because Senate staffers like to come here. It's not just candy inside the office, but Chobani yogurt, one of my favorite treats as well. Now, all you need is a spoon. There'll be parties for hosting. Now from the Senate to the House, the place known for having the most creative giveaway, the Wooly Willy, found inside Representative Glenn Thompson's office. It's the face with the metal filings and you, you put the hair, you put the mustache. Almost all of us have had a Wooly Willy at one time that we got in our Christmas stocking or under the tree or sometime when we were growing up. The toy is made in McKean County, Pennsylvania. Thompson tells us kids are interested in Wooly Willy, but adults love him even more. Reporting in Washington, I'm Jacqueline Pellicastro.